my channel. If you are new, my name is Monica and today I'm going to show you how to make a summer wreath for your front door. I picked up everything from Hobby Lobby. Most of their floral stems and bunches of like the floral bundles and stuff, those were all on sale. The lemons were not on sale, they were $2.99 a piece and the um, grapevine wreath part, the base part that I'm going to use, that was not on sale, that was $4.99. I did use my coupon for that, 40% off. And I'm also going to show you this cute little lemon pillow cover that I made. The fabric was on sale, it was 30% off. And um, I also got the trim from Hobby Lobby as well. So let's just go ahead and get started and I'm going to start by making the wreath and then I will show you how I made the pillow. So I just wanted to quickly show you everything that I'm going to use to make my wreath. And I will use a hot glue just to kind of secure everything in there once I have it placed on the wreath uh, base part. And I just picked up some magnolia leaves and this bundle of like wildflowers and then these lemon bunches right here. So I'm gonna start with the leaves and then I will put the lemons on and then I will place the flowers on last. super cute pillow cover and I love making pillow covers throughout the seasons because that way I'm not going out and buying a new pillow for like summer spring fall winter whatever I just recover it and it is like a brand new pillow and these are super easy to make if you can sew with a sewing machine just a simple straight stitch you can totally make this so easy I am no expert at sewing and I know I do a lot of things 
wrong and take a lot of shortcuts, but you know what? It works for me and I'm not going out and buying a new pillow every time I want to decorate for the seasons. So here is how I do it. I just um, cut out my fabric to the size of the pillow that I want to make and then I cut another piece for the back and what I did was I made the back piece slightly longer because right here I cut straight down the middle and I'm showing you flipping them over like this because I'm showing you that that will be the opening in the back. And that way you don't have to use buttons and you don't have to use a zipper. You'll fold it over. You should probably fold it over twice and then um, take an iron and iron it flat. But I didn't do that. I just kind of folded it over twice right here so it didn't have a raw edge and then I just took my sewing machine and I just took a straight stitch and sewed it all the way down on both sides and then what I will do after that when those two sides are completely sewn I will um, take the two pieces of fabric actually three pieces of fabric the two for the back that I will have for the opening and then the piece of fabric that I will have for the front side of my pillow and I'm showing you right here um, I will do the right side facing pieces in so it will be like inside out and then I'm just going to take my straight pins and I'm just going to pin it all the way around and then I will sew completely around and that will be your pillow and yeah it's that easy something about the way you make me feel cause I can't concentrate anytime you're beside me yeah it's what you do to me I can bring I've been thinking about you and all the words that I'm gonna say the next time that I see a pretty face cause I can concentrate anytime you're beside me yeah it's what you do to me I can barely breathe it's what you do I'm so happy with it. I think that it matches perfectly with this green couch that I have here in my front room. I am totally obsessing over the lemons for summertime this year. If you guys are on the lemon kick as well, please go ahead and leave me a comment down below. I would love to know what your thoughts are with the lemons this year, as long as they aren't mean thoughts. Those will be deleted. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love it if you left me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you are new, and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. Bye.